this video I'm going to show you how to restore a 8 gigabyte iPod touch to factory settings okay so this is an 8 gigabyte as you can see iPod touch I'm going to restore this to factory settings so first thing we have to do is to take our iPod sync cable and connect it the other side is already connected to the computer The first thing we're going to have to do is open up iTunes. Computer, as you can see, detected. I have my settings to open iTunes when the iPod is connected, so it automatically opens iTunes. As you can see, it already detected the iPod. There it is right there on the devices. There's the iPod and there's a button restore now keep in mind you when you restore your iPod to factory settings it's going to erase any data that you have on the iPod so make sure you want to back up anything in the iPod before you do this so let's click on restore you have a choice to back up data or not back up so if you want a clean restore to factory settings and you want to wipe everything off you can select don't back up if you want to back up the data that you have on the iPod if you want to do that you can back it up so you have to make that decision now so I'm gonna choose don't back up because I already have all the data that's on my iPod on my computer so I'm gonna choose don't back up and then click restore and you just go to next agree So basically once the software update is done, then the iPod will restore to factory settings. As you can see, the status bar is almost complete in connection with this. The and there you go. iPad has been restored to factory settings.